Well, beginning today, people will once again be able to visit a U.S. landmark that played a key role in American history. And news host Lisa LaRocca is already stopping by because this is in our own backyard. She is there this morning at Phillips Manor Hall in Yonkers. Lisa. Yeah, good morning to you guys. Good morning, everyone. Oh, good. The bus is moving. All right, excellent. So this is Phillips Manor Hall. It's one of the oldest historic sites in the United States, dating way back to the 1600s. You know, I learned yesterday there was a time where they were talking about tearing this down because it had kind of fallen apart and uh, they were going to tear it down for development. What an absolute shame that would have been. Well, it was closed for the past 18 months, undergoing a state-funded $20 million renovation. Absolutely gorgeous. With the renovation, though, also comes a deeper look into the story behind Phillips Manor Hall. Now, the home was built by Dutchman and British loyalist Frederick Phillips. He is an architect whose family amassed great fortune. But now more of the story is being told within the exhibits, not just about the family. They're talking about uh, how the Phillips family made their fortune on land that was taken from indigenous people and the enslavement of people who were forced to work the land. Now, Governor Kathy Hochul came for Wednesday's ribbon cutting ceremony and unveiling of the renovations. And she said restoring sites like this is important because it really is an investment in education. And and that's why the whole story needs to be told. For generations from now, he will understand the real story of New York, uh, the good, the bad, the ugly. Uh, it's a story that needs to be reminded of, so we always look forward and say, we'll never look backwards and say that was acceptable in our society. Now, Phillips Manor Hall officially reopens today to the public, so there's much to explore. Did you know this building actually served as Yonkers City Hall back in the 1800s? And also look for really cool and interesting exhibits that they'll be doing uh, going forward, so you really want to keep checking in. Absolutely worth uh, going and making a visit here. We're in Yonkers. Let's go back to the studio.